Are you tired of getting on a flight and not having enough leg room or you sit in your seat and you just feel confined for space? Well, today we're gonna to show you how to book your flights with the most leg room. We're gonna be doing this with a free Chrome extension and Google Flights. The Chrome extension is called Leg Rooms for Google Flights. And again, it's totally free. So we'll get right into that in a moment. If you're like myself, I'm six foot one and I have a son that is six foot five. So if we're gonna fly, it would be nice to have the most amount of leg room. So let's go ahead and dive right over to Google Flights, get right into booking flights with the most leg room. All right, so here we are in my Google Chrome browser, and I should mention again that Legrooms for Google Flights, the extension we're using today, is a Google Chrome extension, so you do need to be using Google Chrome for this to work. I will put a link to the extension below in the description. And if you are new here, my name is Ken, and this is Northern Viking Explorer. We bring you videos on travel, exploring, and discovery, so I'd love to have you join the Northern Viking community and subscribe here on YouTube. But let's go ahead and dive right into this. So first off, let's head on over to Google Flights. You can just do a Google search for Google Flights, and it should be the first website that comes up here. I will put a link to their website below in the description so you can easily find it. Make sure you click on flights here on the left-hand side and we can start searching for flights. Now, I happen to be in Canada here, so this will be in Canadian dollars, but if you scroll down to the bottom, you can change the currency here if, it, if you do want a different currency. Now, the way this works is you would select if you want a round trip or one-way multi-city, the number of passengers, so one to however many you like, and your grade of flight. So economy, premium, economy, business, first class, etc. I'll leave it on economy today. And then you would put in your um, city of departure and your destination. So let's do a sample flight today from, let's say we wanna fly from Los Angeles, so LAX. And let's say we wanna to fly to Miami. So you can just start typing that in. You'll see Miami, Florida here. And let's pick some random dates. So you would pick your dates for departure and return over here on the right hand side. So if you click on here, you can look at a calendar. Let's say we want to go on February on the 9th and return on the 16th, just like that. So you can see that all sorts of flights are coming up for various airlines, but you can't see how much legroom you're getting. So this is where the legrooms for Google Flights comes in and it'll show you right in here how much legroom you're going to be getting. So let's go ahead and open up a new tab here. And I'm just going to go ahead and do a search for Chrome extensions and we're gonna to go to the Chrome Web Store. So again, you do need to be using Google Chrome for this to work. And up here where it says search, we're just gonna search for the extension called Legrooms for Google Flights. And this is the extension we're looking for today, Legrooms for Google Flights. And we're gonna go ahead and click on this and you'll see a button here that says Add to Chrome. So we're gonna go ahead and click on Add to Chrome and Add Extension up here at the top and it's gonna add that extension to Google Chrome for us. So now up here in the top right hand corner where your extensions are, you should see the little legroom extension up here. If you're not seeing that, you can also access it by clicking on the three dots here in the top right hand corner, going down to more tools and going to extensions here. And you should see legrooms for Google Flights right in here. Now, if you did wanna turn it on and off, you can do that right here with this toggle switch or you can remove the extension by just clicking right here as well. So we've got that installed here now. I'm gonna actually go ahead and open up Google Flights again. So we're just gonna do Google Flights and we'll open this up and we'll do the exact same search as we did before. So we did LAX to Miami and we did February 9th to the 16th. We'll hit done and it's gonna do that search for us. And all of a sudden, look what happens is legroom starts to show up here on the right-hand side. So you can see this first flight by Spirit Airlines only has 28 inches of legroom. American has 31 inches. Alaska has 31 inches. And you can keep scrolling down if you'd like to get more legroom. You can keep scrolling through here. And all of a sudden, you can see JetBlue has 33 inches of legroom. So you can scroll through here and find the flights with the most legroom and... Again, there's tons of flights here that you could scroll through for sure. So let's say we wanted to go ahead and book one of these flights and let's pick the JetBlue one here, for example, that has 33 inches of legroom. What we would do is just go ahead and select the flight that we'd like. It's gonna bring up some flights that we can select from. Now, for instance here, this first one is actually a one-stop flight and you can see that 
The first leg of the flight is actually 32 inches and the second leg is 33 inches. So um, maybe you want to upgrade and fly non-stop and get 33 inches of leg space the whole way. We go ahead and select whichever flight we want. So that's something to be cognizant of is that just because it's one airline doesn't mean all the um, planes are exactly the same for leg space. So let's go ahead and select this second one here and it's going to take us over to some of the different options here for flights. You can go through that on your own, but when you're ready to book, you just hit select here and Google Flights is going to automatically take you over to the website of the flight carrier that you want to book with and you can just go ahead and book your flight in here. Just make sure again that all the information is correct before you pay. And it's really that simple to book flights with the most legroom using the Google Chrome extension legrooms for Google Flights. So I hope this video was able to give you value in booking your flights with the most amount of legroom. If it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also remember to connect with me on social media and subscribe here on YouTube. I'd love to have you join the Northern Viking community. You will find all those links below in the description. Thank you so much for watching today and until next time, take care.